All right, guys, we're going to do a, a small isolation on Fatal Cross. Just looking at uh, if I can't cross the arms, I'm going to do a sternum instead. So it's a nice place to kind of operate from. Roll my hands out and sticking. This is where I see the attacker, and he's practicing a press on me. Check now. So as soon as I get my strike here, I want to snap his head back there, back out there. On your cross, when you drop, we can start attacking the sternum and keep them back on there and right back to the eyes. Again, you can see heads back out there. I've got a nice groin strike right there. You can hear the click on it. Uh, and then I just drop back in. I keep his back out here. If Michael's to regain leverage at this point, he needs to do a drop and you start to rotate in. What I've done on this piece, let's see how I can catch his angle. As Michael drops, he's starting to roll. I'm monitoring what he's doing. And I got this elbow right here. I got a knee to stop his body, stop, and then as he presses, there's my rotation right there. And I can just feed him right here and under. And you're on the back side out here. Reattach. Now this time I'm pressing into the toes. The knee up. Can you feel that nice shot there? <laughs> Hit. Catch and you got all these nice pops out there if you want. <laughs> so I just wanted to give a little breakout detail there. Attacking the sternum, his press out there, so secondary tags how to walk them through, redirect the body in the head, so.